And so you, you didn't see it coming? No. Taylor Swift and her actor boyfriend, Joe Alwyn, have allegedly called it quits after six years of dating. Taylor Swift, who is currently doing her era's tour that could land her billionaire status, has written numerous tracks dedicated to the English actor. The news of their breakup has been circulating around social media for some time now, shaking fans to the core. According to a report by Entertainment Tonight, a source close to Swift revealed that the couple parted ways a few weeks ago, and the split was not dramatic. According to the source right before they broke up, Joe was talking about marrying Taylor. However, she didn't see it working out in the long run and according to People magazine, Joe was really struggling with Taylor's level of fame with an insider saying, the differences in their personalities have also become harder to ignore after years together. But I think that, you know, if something's toxic and it's only ever really been that, what are you gonna do? It's like, uh, just move on. It's fine. As soon as the news was released, fans started to dig into the matter and came up with different theories. A fan found a video of Taylor in which she can be seen being emotional while singing her song Champagne Problems, a song that is all about broken hearts, sadness, and starting over. Fans assumed that the singer might be insinuating at her breakup using this song. But that is not it. The news came out weeks ago amid Taylor Swift's era's tour, at which the actor has not been spotted. While some have taken the absence as a sign of confirmation of their breakup, others are still refusing to believe as it's not the first time that Swift's relationship has been met with fake rumors. One fan also tweeted I will not be believing any breakup rumors because you cannot tell me that Taylor Swift wrote Cornelius Street, The Great War, and sweet nothing about this man only to have an amicable breakup. A fan also revealed that Joe Alwyn missed Taylor Swift's concert because he was filming in Europe, which made some fans hope that they're still together. However, as the rumor mill continues to spin out of control, one can't help but wonder if Taylor's diehard fans are simply clinging to false hope and refusing to accept the heart-wrenching truth. Taylor Swift, who has been entertaining fans since the time she joined the music industry, has always been a news either for her outstanding music or her love life. Over the years, the singer has been involved in various relationships, most of which didn't survive for long. But with Joe Alwyn's entry, it seemed that the Lavender Hayes singer had finally found the right one. However, now with the rumors of their breakup, it looks like the singer is going to be heartbroken once again. Some eagle-eyed fans noticed that Taylor Swift hinted at her breakup with Joe Alwyn late last month. During her era's tour, Taylor swapped out the song Invisible String, which celebrates true love and is about Joe Alwyn, with The One, a song about lost love and what could have been. Taylor Swift's fans and followers were puzzled. It didn't seem to make sense that she could write songs like Great War and Afterglow, which were about Joe accepting her and not leaving her after she had caused a fight by overreacting to something. Something didn't add up, and let's not forget the iconic line from Cornelius Street. On one of her Instagram reels, she revealed that her latest song, Lavender Haze, was specifically inspired by her six-year relationship with longtime boyfriend, actor Joe Alwyn. Despite dealing with weird rumors and tabloid stories throughout their relationship, they have learned to ignore them. The song highlights the importance of disregarding such gossip and protecting the real aspects of their relationship. Lavender Haze is track one on Midnight, and I happened upon the phrase Lavender Haze when I was watching Mad Men. And I looked it up because I thought it sounded cool. And it turns out that it's a common phrase used in the 50s where they would just describe being in love. Like, if you were in the lavender haze, then that meant that you were in that all-encompassing love glow. And I thought that was really beautiful. Like, my relationship for six years, we've had to dodge weird rumors, tabloid stuff, and we just ignore it. Um, and so this song is sort of about the act of ignoring that stuff to protect, to protect the real stuff. I hope you guys like it. It should be noted that Swift has a history of writing songs about her ex-boyfriends like All Too Well, We Are Never Ever Getting Back Together, Back to December, and Forever and Always. These songs are about her breakups and relationships with her former partners. And according to one TikToker, Midnight is the breakup album and Midnight Rain is the breakup song. Nights was the breakup album, and I can prove it. Obviously, Swift Talk is going crazy right now after the news broke that Joe and Taylor split up. And it's very sad, and I hope they're both doing well. But I've been seeing a lot of Swifties comment stuff like, are we gonna get a breakup album? Best see. I think we already have it. It dropped last summer, and it's called Midnights. I don't really know. Midnight Rain is 
the breakup song. We all thought it was about like Tom Hiddleston or something. What if it was about Joe this whole time? I broke his heart because he was nice. He was sunshine. I was midnight rain. He wanted it comfortable. I wanted that pain. He wanted a bride. I was making my own name. The news articles are saying they split because her fame was too much for him. She says in this song that she picked her career over this guy that was sunshiny. Taylor Swift's relationship with Joe Alwyn has been different from all of her past relationships because, unlike the previous ones, the couple had decided to keep this relationship behind closed doors. When Taylor Swift began dating Joe Alwyn back in 2017, she didn't make it public or posted any pictures of them together. However, Taylor did give out some hints to her fans by dropping love songs like Gorgeous, Cornelius Street, etc. that she wrote especially for her boyfriend. In October 2017, Taylor hosted a secret listening session for her album Reputation where she allegedly revealed that the song Gorgeous was about Joe Alwyn, breaking the news of their dating life. In a September 2018 interview with British Vogue, Alwyn confirmed the relationship rumors and acknowledged that fans were always curious about his and Swift's relationship and their desire to be kept informed. Since then, fans have been supporting and rooting for their favorite couple. However, now the current news of Joe and Taylor going separate ways has created havoc among Swifties. While some fans are heartbroken, others are skeptical and believe the news to be untrue. One person tweeted, Taylor Swift breaking up with the person she wrote piece about has the potential to be absolutely catastrophic for the girls. Another tweeted Taylor Swift and Joe Alwyn have broken up 35 times, gotten engaged 22 times, gotten married 12 times, and have been pregnant 6 times according to The Sun and Entertainment Tonight. Nobody believes that. Their only source is that he isn't at the Eras tour. He's literally been in Europe filming a movie. That's why. At a point in time, Swift was even rumored to have been secretly engaged to Alwyn when she was spotted wearing a big diamond ring. Later on, another rumor of the couple being married had come out but soon it died when no statement was made from the couple's side. Well, nobody knows the actual truth as the couple hasn't addressed the matter. Thus, it makes perfect sense why fans are still hoping for the news to be false. People have been expressing their sorrow and concern for the couple on different social media platforms. One user commented, I'm so sad. They both are awesome. I hope this is fake news. I thought finally Taylor is in stable news. Now this. God why? Another wrote, I'm waiting for Taylor to say something about this if it comes directly from her. I'll believe it because media can spin all sorts of things. Another said, no I'm not ready for it. Such devastating news. And many more. Since the singer and the actor have been caught up with their respective professional lives, they haven't released any statement about the breakup which leaves Swifties with some hope. Fans have been praying for news to be fake as they can't bear to see their favorite couple splitting away. Well, whatever it is, we only wish good to the couple. Now, I would like to know your thoughts. Do you think the breakup rumor is true, or is it just another tabloid rumor? Let me know in the comments down below, and please subscribe to the channel for more celebrity drama.